Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you this custom Lego brick head mock of the new monster shown in the trailer for Stranger Things Season 3, which was, in my opinion, the best season of Stranger Things yet. However, make sure to be aware of the rest of this video if you've not seen Season 3 yet, because there will be some spoilers. Without further ado, let's begin the video and check out this mock. After watching Season 3 of Stranger Things, I was super excited to try and build the new monster which is formed from the blood and guts of rats and people. Yup, it's it's pretty gross. At first, this was going to be a standalone action figure, but after further redesigning, I figured that it would be more fun to try and make the monster as a brickhead. However, if you guys do still want me to make this guy as an action figure, then make sure to tell me in the comments below. I built this brickhead using mainly dark red, but I also included some normal red, transparent red, and black, along with white teeth. The front of the head includes a row of teeth sticking out at different angles that I attached by sticking the modified bricks onto some 1x2 jumper plates. The rest of the head continues a curved form with some bumps and ridges here and there. The sides of the head have some black spikes and extra limbs, or whatever those things are growing out of the sides of the monster, but I think that they ended up giving the monster a very cool, deformed sort of look. For building the body of the monster, I didn't stick to my regular brickhead style. Instead of making a body with two arms and two legs, I had the body take up the entirety of the lower portion of the brickhead with limbs in odd places. Extending out of one side of the monster is the long, soul-sucking apparatus that the monster uses to make its victims join its army. It's basically a long, curving tube with a claw at the end. The other side of the monster has another limb that just extends into the ground, and on the back of the monster I've attached two spikes that stick out and add to the creepy vibe of the monster. And that was all for the Brickhead. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. I had a blast building this thing because I could experiment and improvise all I wanted due to this creature needing to look weird. And I think that I achieved exactly that. A weird build. Anyways, thank you so much for watching this video. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe. And I'll see you next time.